Okay, guys, I am back with another video. And as you far watch, the previous video had well on views, likes. Yeah, well, then I check it. But this one is a personal one for my, yeah, well, one of my friends, Ronan. Because I asked him, because he asked me what's next, and so I didn't upload last week. Uh, I can tell you people are going to ask why, but yeah. Obviously, because I'm pumping out videos every day this week, so, yeah. But, that's a bit like, especially for Ronan, as, a, as from a YouTuber to a fan, so he's one that's actually very active. So, yeah, let's get into the video. As we left off on, what's the name, day two, um, I... Yeah, kind of didn't save. We did kind of didn't save, so I had to go do something. Instead of keeping the boombox, I tossed it into the water and made them angry. But yeah, that's only the major change I made in the stuff. Yeah. The rest is all the same. Wake up. Uh, okay, Delilah. Hey, wake up. I'm awake. I'm awake. I'm awake. What's your problem? Our problem. Sorry, our problem. That storm knocked out the phone line I used to talk to the service, which means we're cut off. I tried radioing out, and that's not working either. Uh... I don't really know why that would be the case. There's no backup? The backup is the two-day hike out of here. So, that's a no? It's easier for me to send all the lookouts out to check the status of the wire in their areas. Yours is a good hike away. If you find any portion of it down, I can try to get a hold of a ranger, and he'll bring someone in to fix it. Okay, I can do that. Where is it? Remember that cave you hiked through yesterday? Yeah, of course. So, you're gonna want to go back there, go through it, and keep going straight to the north when you come out. Will do. Thanks, Hank. Yeah, I like organizing this stuff. Uh, yeah, anything else I should take, might know, hey picture with the Lala, put you back, put my mic back, I know, I can't see if I'm wearing my wedding ring, but supposedly I should be. Yeah. Okay, let's get out there. I know I make very long videos. Yeah, this is in the right place, so. Yeah. Okay, people, um, can you see the communication wires from where you are? I can see the poles, but I have no idea if the wire is in good shape or not. They run a good distance up to a spot called Beartooth Point. You just need to walk along them all the way up there and make sure everything's in ship shape. But it's far to them walk all the way. I'm just skipping all of that. So much faster going down this way. Oh, it's 
It's actually pretty damn cold out here. Roger that. Warms up fast. The mornings are cold in Boulder, though, right? Yeah, they are. What did you get up to down there? I mean, what's life like? Uh, it's a talk around me. Uh, you know, uh, I, I don't know. Just used to spend a lot of time with our dog, Mayhem. Mayhem? What kind of name is that? He was a German Shepherd, big as a truck. So, why not call him Chevy? Well, we, uh, we walked out of the shelter and there was some graffiti on a trash can and it said, Dicko Mayhem. And, um, he walked over and peed all over it and there you go. <laughs> That's a really cute story? It is what it is. Hey, can you hold on a sec? Uh, sure. Just gonna keep hiking and hoping it warms up. Hey, yo. I don't think so. Why, have you? <laughs> okay, good. Do I know what Eddie's all about? No, I don't think he has any idea. I'm absolutely sure. Would you? Alright, I'll let you know if anything changes in that regard. Mm. Hey, sorry about that. Anyway, I, I feel wow. about it, and that story is cute, and, um, sorry, but, but you said we? You, you owned him with someone? <sighs> that would be my wife, Julia. Oh, like, like your wife, or like she's taken half my stuff wife? My wife. But you're here. I shouldn't be here. She's sick, and I shouldn't be here, but I am. I... I'm sorry, Henry. What is it? We'll get into it. Okay. Well, in the meantime, you are here, and it's beautiful, and escaping isn't always something bad. Yeah, sure. Look, I gotta go do a thing, but I'll have a radio. Okay, call me if you need to. Okay! I really don't mind her asking. She can now, but what will she do with the info? Sorry, people. As I said before, my remote is a problem. It's always just going up. Okay, that's a leap. Yeah, my phone, my, not my phone, my remote, I think. I said phone, but, but my remote. The button to do all this, if I leave it for some reason, it just keeps on going up. As you saw right there. Um, okay. I'm so used to Fallout and all the other games. But note, I'm recording this after the Fallout video, so I wouldn't know how the Fallout video is done. Well. Uh, let's see anything important. Not from Dave. Uh, the bike explodes. I'm not the only one who heard that, right? Whoa, I, uh, I found a turtle. Maybe it's a, a tortoise. It's a thing with a shell. Well, isn't that something? actually pretty cute. Well, Henry, if you decide you want it to keep you company, nobody will mind. Now what do I call it? Looks like a, uh, hmm. I'd name it Mayhem Jr. I thought it'd be good. Mayhem Jr. <laughs> Perfect. I think so. Okay, adopt. Well, that's the only reason why I actually must have came here, but the crawling in the bushes. I'm not so sure about. I just put down, so that's why I went a bit skew. Um, yeah. Now, I know. Guess what? What is it? There's a bunch of empty cans up here. Same as before? Yep. These fucking kids. Okay. How can these girls be so stupid? 
Trust me, I never underestimate the stupidity of a drunk teenager. Also, I never underestimate the balls of a drunk young woman, having been one. The balls of a young... Do you mean boobs or head? Yeah. Uh, yeah, okay, the wire's down here. Okay, good. Any sign of those girls? Did they mess with anything? I'll look around. Hey, so the wire is definitely down out here. I just found it. <laughs> yeah, the thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was cut deliberately. I knew it the moment you said you found their trash. <sighs> These idiots are gonna pay. Do they realize this is how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? And God forbid there's an actual fire burning out of control. What do you want to do? I want you to go find them. And then what? I... I haven't thought that far ahead. That's not true. Everything that comes to mind is... I mean, I don't know. Let's hear it. Oh, yeah? Hey, I came out here for a breath of fresh air and some adventure. What do you got? I think I want you to just find them and scare the hell out of them. Yeah, I'd make a spooky ghost costume, but they stole my sheets. Hmm, I don't know. Um... Wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp. Something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy. <laughs> I'll find them. Thanks. But I am going to need a raise. <sighs> Don't hold your breath. I'd start by hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything okay. that would to them. Okay. Let's see. Oh, they're big and What's next? Huh, great. See if you can find the path they took down from there. Maybe they looped back around towards the lake or something. I doubt they're where they were yesterday, but they obviously can't have gone far. Well, okay, um, yeah. There's an abandoned pack out here. And it's not one of the teens? No, it looks like it was lost a long time ago. Well, you could always pilfer it for supplies. Yeah, people just ignore the sound. Well, I am flush with ropes now. That pack was full of them, in decent condition, too. That's lucky. I mean, there's there's enough rope here that I could just leave them hooked up, I think. Oh, get this. This uh, pack came with one of those cardboard <laughs> single-use cameras. With pictures left? Yeah, he only used three or four. Neato. Thank you, Brian Goodwin. Wait, wait, who? The bag had the name Brian Goodwin sewn into the top. Do you know him? Yeah, I just haven't heard that name in a few years. Um, Ranger. Was he a ranger or something? Oh, no, no. He was stationed in Two Forks, your lookout, with his dad, Ned, three summers ago. Great kid. You can bring children out here? No. You know, I'm not a stickler for rules. They took off halfway through the summer. Uh... Is Ned that guy from the note I told you about? About the guy leaving his post? Oh, uh, could be, yeah. But I think at one point they just realized this job wasn't for them. For Brian, at least. Huh. Anyway, so it goes. Have, uh, fun with that camera. Try not to snap anything that would scar a Photodome employee. I don't know, I got a lot of hiking to do. Might get bored. Well, I'm bored as rocks, so I'll keep you company while you find those girls, huh? Who are these guys, Ron and Dave? They're leaving notes for each other in the boxes. Is there any chance one of them was that guy I saw in the canyon? You know, the guy with the flashlight? No, they're both rangers. They're not out here this season. I didn't really know them that well, but I always assumed the only thing Ron cared about was chasing tail and getting loaded. It's somehow mm -hmm. comforting to know that he was able to keep up a correspondence with someone who wasn't going to send him a topless Polaroid. Okay, well, I'm gonna use a disposable camera. Hey, cool. Next.
friends. Hey, uh, Delilah? What do you got? You found him? Uh, no, not yet. Why would there be a fence out here? Oh, uh, because sometimes hikers go ass over tea kettle when on a trail. So the Forest Service would put up a big chain link fence? A chain link fence? Yeah. It looks like it surrounds a huge area. Huh. That's weird. Um. What do you think they're keeping in? What do they not want to have get out of there? Oh. Jeez, so many things. Should I just stop you now? Maybe loads of hedgehogs. Okay. Thousands even. Full percentage points of the global hedgehog population. Uh-huh. <laughs> the New Zealand government is, is up in arms. Where are all the hedgehogs? <laughs> well, folks are hiding them all in Wyoming. That's where they are. Who would do that and why? Ha-ha. <laughs> that is the real mystery. Really glad I kept you in the loop. Thanks for all of the high-quality information. Okay, okay. I'll ask what's up if I talk to someone in the next few days who I think might know. From this burned section of forest, I have no idea where to go. Their trail is pretty cold at this point. Hmm, you're out by Mule Point. No one would camp out in the fireweed. Well, I want you to stay out there, as a favor to little old me. My pleasure. <sighs> okay, we know these young women are sloppy. They must have left some sort of trail. <laughs> yes, guys, sorry for the leg. Yeah. Solid. I'll have to keep that one in my pocket. It's all yours. Well, now let's calm down. of a natural bridge out here. Really? Is it a complete arch? Uh, no, I guess the bridge is out here. Still, I think I could jump this gap to get across the canyon. Wow, you're a regular evil Knievel. Oh yeah, you should see the jumpsuit I'm wearing. I don't know why it's lagging, guys, but hopefully it doesn't crash, but in case it does, then we save yet. I'm saved. I see a really thin plume of smoke. Yeah, I see it too. A thin plume like this is either a new fire or a campfire. A campfire? You think it's them? <sighs> I reckon so. It looks like it's to the southwest of me. That's right. If you hike towards Five Mile Creek, that should put you in the neighborhood. Keep an eye on that smoke plume. Let me know if it's getting any larger. Will do. Okay, well. Turn the light. I can't actually see it. But I think, yeah, yeah, but... got Alzheimer's. Like, um, dementia. Whoa. How old was she? Is she? She's alive. She's with her family in Melbourne, Australia. She's 43. Fuck. Yeah. What was it like when you guys found out? Devastating. Especially for her. You can understand. And for you. Anyway, everything she worked for was taken away, oh, yeah. and that was... Oh, I get that. Yeah. I'm sorry to be such a downer. Don't, don't, don't even. I don't know why you put this animation in. You know, we'll try to have some... So wrong. I promise. 
and to get back to Purple Goat. I'm down by Cripple Gulch. You ready to give it another shot? Uh, do I seriously have to? To get down to Five Mile Creek? Yeah, afraid so. It's quite a ways downhill from here. Uh, well, we could always go the other way. I can't do any star work on all the way around, but now I ain't got time for that. But sometimes I know I play this game the game this game again. It gave me some odd like kind of a creepy vibe. Because I'm crawling around in the bushes earlier and remember I'm listening to this like through earphone because yeah I cannot I struggle to match up like if I have to listen to the TV in the background. I struggle to match up audio. I don't want to be stuck doing that when I could just as easily do it when I'm one second off. And I'm recording with my phone. Um, uh, um, voice. Oh, I always wondered what the heck is down here. Oh, it's just a gigantic circle around that big rock. Anyways. Supply cash. Uh, what do you have? I think I'll mess this in my first playthrough. Hikers go missing in the Shoshone. More than none, unfortunately, with most of them being in this area. The thoroughfare because it's so remote. Why? I found an old flyer for a missing hiker. It just got me thinking, that's all. Like how you said one day you were talking to the Goodwins and then the next you weren't. Ned Goodwin didn't get mauled by a bear or stuck in a ravine. He was just a PTSD day hole who dragged his son out to do a job and realized it was a bad idea. PTSD? That doesn't sound good. Yeah, I don't know. He was in the army. He was... off. It's actually the saddest story. He was only discharged because his mother, Brian's grandmother, died. She'd been taking care of him, and Ned was the only next of kin. Damn. And you got to know Brian a little bit? Yeah. I talked to him way more than I talked to Ned, that's for sure. How was he at, uh, you know, spotting fires? <laughs> I would like to stay in the tower. Well, for as dry as it is this summer, there's an area down here that's uh, lush. Oh, you must be talking about the Aspen Grove down there. Yeah, I think that's where I am. Those trees are actually one root organism. Did you know that? I didn't. Yeah, they share their water as a colony that can live for hundreds of years, even through fire. Can you believe you're actually getting paid to learn all of these amazing things? Also, uh, by what it looks like on this map, you'll be coming up on a stream that should lead you towards where we saw that smoke. Okay... Look almost like a fire that was a shadow. It's a really nice waterfall down here. Even those girls love a skinny dipping, I bet they're nearby. Uh, there's some cloth out here. It looks like it was torn from something. Strange. I'll keep looking around. And the thing is, music just adds to the vibe of like, what the heck is going on? I see a campsite and it looks like they've got a fire. Is it them? That seems like it. I swear, they must have drank four cases of beer out here. Track them down and don't let them see you. What a job this is. I have entered the teen zone. Oh, really? And where's that? It's the name of a magazine for girls. It's on the ground here at their camp. Well, I found some dangerous hunks. What on earth are you 
it's another one of those magazines. The tent looks like it's been through the shredder, which would explain that scrap I found. What could have done that? Like a, like a bear or, um, I don't know, it sounds crazy, but even a bull elk if it's off its rocker. Whatever did it, did not hold back. You've got that camera, right? It might be a good idea to get a few snaps, just in case. Yeah, good thinking. Uh, looks like someone left a note. Intriguing. Maybe you should read it. Okay, yeah. Let me know what it says. You know, maybe I should take one of their sleeping bags as payback. At this stage, take whatever you want. Uh, some of their clothes are all torn up. Uh, that's not good. Oh, they're gone for sure. Well, what's it say? Um, just hold on. Worry. I hope you're effing happy. We're leaving you and we're, far we're going to find the police or uh, whatever. And tell them about how you creeped on us at the lake. And then you came and destroyed our campsite and all that stuff. Oh, and see our panties that's clear. I did not do that. I know that sounds weird on recording, but I did not do that. Um, it's gross out. You're probably mental. Uh, you're probably a mental FNX murderer, so. And you are going to jail. I hope it was worth uh, being a jerk over some fireworks, Dick. I am Dick Grayson. I'm a man. I am my psychic. I'm a man. And they're calling the police. Threatening to call the police because they think I attacked them. Oh my god, well, uh, did you? Um. No, well, hey, I didn't do this. Okay, someone or something went to town here, but it wasn't me. Because I told you to scare them, not assault them. I didn't. Of course I didn't. I just threw their stereo in the lake. Yeah, I really wish you wouldn't have done that. This is, I don't know, weird as hell, but it wasn't me. It's, it's okay. I believe you. Weird stuff happens in the woods. It could be other campers. They could be having a bad mushroom trip. We really don't know. But they're gone. There's no way to call the cops. They're not coming back. And we can get to work. I'd really like to start enjoying a quiet summer. Yeah, me too. Day three. We made it thus far. I think I'm going to finish day three then. We'll go on out and then just like... Keep it peace and calm. Like nice and calm. Whatever. You understand what I'm meaning. And the thing is, I noticed Magic cut when he walks, but I don't cut when I walk because I might be silent, but I start walking now and again. Um, yeah. Hey, Henry? Yeah. Um, what do you look like? I'm a man! Why are you asking? Because I'm horribly superficial. Uh. Do you know Raleigh Fingers? He pitched for the A's. I'm the spitting image of him. Oh, wait, is he the guy with the snidely whiplash thing going on from, from the 70s? Oh, my dad loved him. Yeah, that's him. That mustache. Mm. Now you have my attention. Oh, good. Okay, well, that gives me a good start. Now let's see. In my scope, I can only tell you're a white guy wearing shorts. It's... Hot. And maybe, by the way, I'm not white. It's not very, uh, you know, PC or whatever they say. Oh my god, you are the whitest man. And you are the white. I don't need a spotting scope for that. And if not shorts, then what do you normally like to wear? Uh. 
Tuxedos as often as possible. Oh, really? Oh, no, Kingsman. How cosmopolitan. I didn't realize Boulder was so chic. It is the peak of high society. Mm, the drunk. Bad, yes. Now tell me about your face. I'm looking at you across the bar. What do I see? Uh, <laughs> uh, Well, I have a thin mustache, real thin mustache. I got a, a long scar, goes down across my eye and down my cheek. And you only wear tuxes. Yeah. Hmm. Are you a freaking Bond villain? I, uh, I, I get up to some stuff, yeah. I don't think you're taking this very seriously. I want to know about your eyes. Get out of here. I'm drawing you. I need to know. You're what? Is that okay? Uh... Don't... Don't answer. I'm gonna do it regardless. Fine. Your eyes. Tell me. <laughs> uh, they're happy, I think. I mean, I've been told they look happy. Julia told you that, huh? Look, I don't know how to describe eyes. Happy is good. That's good. Okay, got it. Thank you, Henry. You get what you need? Absolutely. I remember this. What in here, yeah, but uh, yeah. So I think giving the option to board up the window that means I'm missing a piece of wood. And you guys have probably seen me running around here, yeah, like searching my ass off for it. Uh, yeah, let me try again because I'm sure I got all the pieces. I can look up nothing. I got nothing to select. Oh, center block. We are. Okay, I'm sure I only need three, but since I was talking to the lag, I don't think it gave me the option. Now it does. Boarding <laughs> up windows are just that easy, people. I got that window all patched up. So, what should I do now? What's next? What's next? What do you think is next? Well, you've been the one giving me tasks for two days straight. What's next is you sit in that room until September 1st and call me at the first sign of smoke. Wow. Oh. September 1st yeah. passed a month ago. Why don't you let me know when you're mentally prepared for that task and uh, I'll give it to you. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, I think I am ready to tackle my long-term commitment of keeping this national forest safe from total destruction. Just let me say... <laughs> I am glad to hear you've really thought this through. Of course. We've issued you a comfy chair to sit in and everything. You know, it's not really that comfy. It's wooden and there's no padding. I think I actually got a splinter in my thigh this morning. Aww. Well, regardless, take a seat. The forest depends on you. Okay, day nine. Take your stuff very fast. <laughs> And I think I've hit about the half an hour mark or somewhere close to there. Which means I'll call it the end very soon. Hello Henry, having a nice afternoon? Not too bad. I could get used to it out here. That's nice. Look, um, I called with bad news. Two young women, Chelsea Stevens and Lily McLean, were reported missing. They've got parents out in California who haven't heard from them in a week. They were supposed to meet an aunt down in Cody. 
If they're the girls from last week, then you're probably the last person to have seen them. Uh, you should tell whoever that I'm happy to be questioned. I caused them some trouble, but nothing major. I'd never even got very close to them. Well, uh... One stereo, that's it. Look, it's not gonna be an issue. Uh, I mean, if, if they turn up dead, then maybe. Should I just not say anything and save us the trouble? It's worth mentioning. I... I think it's worth mentioning something. Yeah. I'll, uh... I'll, I'll keep it vague. I, I really don't want to talk to the cops. Me neither. All right, Henry, thanks. Enjoy the sunset. Yeah. Day 15. Well, I have an answer as soon as I can pull it. I'll call it the NDI. But, yeah, this is supposed to be a round of five. Six hour game in total we played non-stop but yeah let's just wait Henry Henry wake up get out of bed and pick up the radio I remember this but Game. Okay, guys, I am gonna call it to end for this one, this video. As we speak, my Fallout 4 one, it will really be up, but and uh, at the moment, our Fallout 4 video is busy uploading. I'm gonna edit this and edit up by tomorrow. But yeah, at the time, I'll be calling it the Fallout 4 video. I hope it's uploaded today. Oh, not today, but I want to paint up this on Tuesday. This video, far watch, but for the Fallout 4 video, I want to upload today, Monday. But yeah, hopefully, it's all that get through. But yeah, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Like, comment, and subscribe for more content. And I'll see you in the next video. Adios.